Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I will show you how to crochet this pet collar. If you are new to my channel, I'm sharing coaching ideas every week. Please subscribe and turn notification. Now let's begin. Firstly, we will find white yarn and make a slip knot. Then we will work chains, depends on the size of our pet's neck. Here I'm working 50 chains as an example. Now we have our chains. Then we will chain two more as the turning chain. Now we will find the fourth chain from the hook and work one double crochet. Now we just continue to work double crochet in each space until the end. Here we come to our last double crochet, and we will continue to finish this and cut off the yarn. Now we will change to black yarn and work row 3. So firstly, we still make a slip knot. Then we connect the black yarn to the first place in the white part. Here we just work one single crochet in each space until the end. Now we will finish our last single crochet and cut off the yarn. Before moving on, we need to head all tails. Now we will work the white pad. This part will be under the collar and the bow knot. So here we will find the white yarn and make a double circle. Now we insert the hook and chain 2 to start. Here we do not count this 2 as a double crochet.
Now we will work eight double crochet in the circle. So here we got our first one. Now the second. Here we have eight double crochet. We will then close the circle. To do this, we firstly pull through the tail, and we will notice one part is moving. We will then pull through the moving part to close the circle as tight as we can. Finally, we pull through the tail again. In this way, the circle is super tight, so we can cut off the tail now. Now we will start to work round two, and we still chain two, and do not count this two as a stitch. Then in this row, we will work two double crochet in each space. By end of this row, we will have sixteen double crochet. Now we finish the row two, and we'll start row three. Every time we start a new row, we will chain two, and don't count it as a stitch. In row three, we will firstly work one double crochet. Then in the next space, we will work two double crochet as one increase. And we will repeat this until the end. By end of this row, we will have twenty-four stitches. So here we finished row three. Row four and row five are following similar pattern. Here, the bigger pad has five rows. If you have a big pad, you might need to work five rows, which is a bigger pad. In this video, I will just stop by row four. In row four, we still chain two to start. Then we turn to the other side. Now, in the first two spaces, we will work one double crochet in each space. Then in the third space, we will work one increase, which means two double crochet, and we will repeat this pattern until the end. By end of this row, we will have thirty-two stitches. If you need to work row five, you can just follow the pattern on the screen. So here we finished round four. Later, we will put this under the collar. If you work the row five, you will get a bigger pad. Now we cut off the yarn and head the tail before moving on. From this part, we will work the bow knot. To do this, we need to find a black yarn and start with a slip knot. Basically, we will work a black rectangle and fold it into a bow knot. So first, today we will work eleven chains. Then 
Then we'll find the second chain from the hook and work one single crochet. In this row, we we'll just work one single crochet in each space, and by end of this row, we will have ten stitches. Now we finished the first row. Then we will chain one and turn to the other side. Every time we finish one row, we will do this, and we do not count this turning chain as a stitch. Then from the current space, we just work one single crochet in each space, and we will work ten rows to get a rectangle. So here we have our rectangle. Finally, we can work some single crochet along edges to get clean edges. Every time when it comes to the corner, we can work two single crochet. Now we can cut off the yarn and head the tail. Finally, we just assemble every part and done.